grace of Christ be with you always. As we celebrate the 27th Sunday in ordinary time, you see, I just want you to understand that faith is central and very necessary in our Christian life. That is why I want to reflect with you on the theme, faith produces results. In the first reading of today, the prophet Habakkuk asks his people to have faith in God because he can do it. In their difficulty, in their despair, in the injustice wrought out for them, to them, God is close and everything will be well. He said, it will surely come. Be patient. In his encounter with the apostles, Jesus maintained that when they have a little faith like a master seed, they can root out a sycamore tree. A man of faith is a man of action, for he has within himself that fountain of energy. Faith is that fountain of energy within us that makes us produce his result. In Mark chapter 5, the woman who had a flow of blood for 12 years had little faith and he said, when I touch the garment of Jesus, I will be healed. And immediately she was healed. With our little faith, we can move the mountain of sickness to get her. In Acts chapter 12, King Herod arrested and jailed Peter. But the people of the church earnestly prayed and Peter was miraculously released. With our little faith in God, God can save us from those who seek to destroy us. God can save us from those who will not allow our dreams to be manifested. There are some of us who have prayed for a long time and we are not getting results. We have prayed for good health. We have prayed for academic excellence. We have prayed for success. We have prayed for promotion, but we are not getting results. We are discouraged and some of us don't even want to hear the name of God. It seems slow for us, but I want to encourage you today. Go through the tunnel with faith and you'll get the result. It will surely come to pass. You'll get the result. May Almighty God bless you today. Bless you with the spirit of faith so that you know that he is closer to you and will grant you whatever you request from him. The Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit.